What's good, everybody? Joshua Jericho here with another episode of Final Fantasy IV, and maybe, maybe the last episode of Final Fantasy IV. We'll have to see. Because we are at the very end of this dungeon, I'm pretty sure, and all that's left now is to destroy the final boss. Zimus Gobez guy face thingy, what's his head? And once he's gone, well, I guess that's it. I don't think there's anything after that. I mean, there's New Game Plus, but I'm not doing that right now. Alright. What are we doing? What are we doing? Where are we going? We could go around. We could go around. We'll go around. I don't know what happened to Cecil, but at some point around level 65, he decided he wasn't going to hit things anymore. Which is really disappointing, because he's so strong. He's like my number one offense, and you can hit like every time. His accuracy is... Accuracy? Accuracy? Accuracy has just gone downhill. His accuracy has gone downhill. His accuracy has become what my conversation skills are, which is poor. My ability to grammatically pronounce things correctly. Not top-notch. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna try one, one room at a time. Let's we'll see what we got up here. Oh, this must be another weapon for somebody. Is that a spear? Those who seek this hallowed lance shall have naught but their damnation. Yeah! Leghorn. Why does Zemus just keep a bunch of awesome weapons lying around? He's got nothing better to do. Oh, crap. Are you serious? Wow. Okay. Um. Yo, it's all out, man. Does he have a weakness, maybe? Well, it's nice of him to cast taste on everybody. Unless the haste also makes the countdown go faster, which I don't think it does. Wouldn't that be evil? Like, and also your countdown is sped up. No weaknesses. Why would he have a weakness? That would just be easy. No, don't put on shell. Oh, never mind. That was not that hard. <laughs> it was like, I was thinking it was gonna get down to like a one second timer for people. Like, people are gonna start dropping and like you would die or something. But nope, we're way too strong. Obtain the Holy Lance. Like the holy hand grenade of Antioch. And thou shalt use the holy lance, but only on the count of three. Not on the count of four, for that is too many. Two is right out. 
Well, I hope whatever we're going up against is weak against holy, because I got two holy weapons now. Alright, so does that mean this other room's gonna have a treasure or a weapon in it too? I still wonder if the uh, Masamune is in here. Uh oh. I will not relinquish these blessed relics to the likes of you. Ah, uh, this fight is terrible. If he uses bad breath, which he often does right at the start, pretty much screwed. The only real hope here is I can somehow clock him for enough damage. Cecil, who never hits. I don't know what to do with this. I think he's broken. And there's Kane who also never hits. Ah, but we got him anyway, it's alright. Wasn't pretty, but we got through it. That's a hard fight though, if he doesn't attack first, uh, like he basically will bad breath and bad breath will turn everybody into confused pigs or or uh, toads. They'll all be confused. It's a horrible mess. Disastrous in every way. And, uh, it's no fun. Okay. This has to be it, right? I've gone around the loop. Climbed down here. Completed the map now. This has to be the final... Yes. Maybe. Wait. What? Oh, no! What is this? This isn't more actual map, is it? So it's like a whole nother floor, man. <clears throat> With behemoths all over it, apparently. Which is super great. You're wondering. If you ever thinking to yourself, like, I wonder what would be awesome is if they had a floor with just full of behemoths. It's like when you go into a old, I don't, don't want to say medieval, but like biblical times type dungeon and they're like, and this is our pit of lions. We have a pit of lions downstairs. You know, like that's what it feels like. 
They just have a pit of lions. Well, this place has a pit of behemoths. That's how it feels. Welcome to our behemoth pit. I don't know, it's just boring. The whole thing is dull. Because all you can do is just sit there and slowly hit them, you know? Put Blink on and wait for <laughs> Blink to... Or not blink, wait to blink to wear off, but keep blink up and let him go. And just wait for him to wear out. That's what I was trying to think of. Whole floor. Uh, another behemoth. Look at this behemoth pit. It really is. It's like a giant freaking behemoth piece. I think I've seen one thing that's not a behemoth on this floor. I hope this is the last floor. <clears throat> that's my hope. This is the last floor, and I just fight a bunch of behemoths and get it over with. Even with Rosa nearly dying, it's still an incredibly boring fight. 
None of this fight is fun. Please die, Behemoth. Please die, Behemoth. You should not be alive anymore. I put you upon. With my holy sword and also I jump in ninja to the punch. You could be dead. I don't wanna fight you. Please go away now. I am tired of you. La la la. <clears throat> Sorry. Fights, man. They're just super long and boring. Please stop giving me behemoths. Or keep giving behemoths, but just don't give me any more. Actually, you know what? Just don't give me any more fights. No more fights. Riddy's got zero MP left. Or, I mean, that was Riddy. I don't even know her name is anymore. <clears throat> this character has zero MP left. That's, that's her name. This character. Well, a good thing I have a ton of dry use. Can't use Rydia, because if you cast a spell... If you cast a spell against the Behemoth, it'll do... No, you know, no, no! Can I run now? Maybe I can start running from these things? Yes! I'm just gonna run from everything. You know what? I'm tired of fighting Behemoths. I'm Behemoth out. This is literally a pit of Behemoths. What is going on? I'm done fighting Behemoths. I'm done! I'm done fighting Behemoths. I don't care. I don't need any more levels. These fights are too long and boring. Drop 4,000 gold every turn if I have to. I don't care. I just don't want to play any more games. Oh man, that must be the Masse Mune. I knew it had to be here someplace. Apparently, it was hiding in a pit of the Hemus. Oh wait, everybody's healed up, right? Alright, he'll up enough. Let's see if we can win this fight. Here we go. The ensorcerer blade of Masamune will never bend its will to that of men from the blue planet. <laughs> Where are all the great weapons on the... Ogo Pogo! Why are all the great weapons on our moon? They must have had, like, some amazing... Moon is this. Okay. That's what I think. They must have had some amazing, like, moonsmiths on the moon. I'm just glad this fight's not a behemoth, to be honest, at this point. It was getting just a little on the crazy side. No weaknesses and absorbed water. Of course. Oh, grand. And he counters magic. Well, at least the only counter is magic.
We'll just continue to punch him in his snaky snaws with our amazing holy weapons that we have collected so far. I knew if they were going to give you the Murasami, though, they had to give you the Masamune. Like, the Masamune is kind of like the traditional grand weapon of Final Fantasy ninja type classes. Well, it's ninja of Final Fantasy anything class. Do this, guys. Please don't counter summon. Yeah! My snake's better than your snake. Yes! Masse Mude! Dude, that is so rude that you would, just as I'm at the very end and like I'm about to go down the last pair of steps, you would stop me. Would you want your 10 minutes of fame? Well, you're not getting it because I'm escaping. Screw you, behemoth. Your whole dang pit. This has to be it. Look at, it's got the cool background color now. Cool looking. So like the core of the moon. That must be the ball of cheese. In the center of the moon. That's what's in the middle of the moon. The ball of cheese. Again? Super rude. What is this guy? Is malice. Kind of cool. I don't remember these from before. No, what is this confused thing? Stop that. Don't do that. Is he allowed to do that? Malice is no match for my Bahamut! My blue eyes white dragon! <laughs> okay. This has to be it. So. 
because we spent so much time going through the dungeon, this is not the final episode. The next episode will probably be the final episode, because I'm really good at keeping promises, so we'll see if I can do it. But this has got to be, I mean, because they actually gave me the map, oh, oops, running map. They, they, they actually gave me the map this time. So I'm going to assume I'm just going to walk up there and it's going to be cutscene, battle, in sequence, game over, right? We'll find out. Join me next time. We'll bust some Zemus chops. Thank you guys for watching.